one's the worst. Like this, this one's one the worst. Should be banished <laughs> from the Milky Way. Like nobody should ever use these for drawing ever. They age really poorly, and they always leave a big pink mark on whatever you're trying to erase. And then you can't get rid of the pink mark with another eraser. The Faber Castell has a green eraser that does I the like same one. thing. Oh, oh, it makes my papers this green. One. No, 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 no. This is, this is good. I no, I don't oh, like that. No, 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 no. Come it on. Spice, spice, spice. Green. <laughs> it's my favorite screen. It's so free. How can you, you can, like it? It's so You sweet. can have all of mine. I know how soft it is. That That is what makes See? it the devil because it's seductive. Oh. You think it's going to be great and then it leaves green marks. I it's have done canvases where I'm erasing my lines and it leaves green marks on there instead and then I have to gesso over it. It's horrible. I think you're lying because I worked on a drawing I'm all not. day today I with will this eraser and there's I no green you. marks on it. I will show you. Teach me how to use a green eraser, Clara. I do not know how. The thing that Lord says is so true. They just leave marks everywhere. The only thing I like about it is that it's un a unique shape and it's pink. It's got a, it's just a cool <laughs> shape and everything. But it's more like a paperweight or some sort of table decor than an actual eraser, in my opinion. Back here is the is the person that has it right. These are really good to carve into stamps. You can also get giant pink pearl erasers Ooh, that's can? great if you wanted yeah you can my dad has like three they're great for stamp carving but don't use that oh. as an eraser because it's terrible and it's hard and that's why it's good for stamp carving you see that what makes me mad like the art stores you guys should not be selling this stuff like this, this upsets me that you you are peddling this to the artist this eraser pencil which i see it all the time it's always in one of the pencil kits that you find and these just don't work. You try to erase and it doesn't really erase. It just lets crap go on your paper and then you just dust away the crap and it hasn't really done anything. So to me, this is just the dumbest eraser ever. The one experience I had was really negative. You guys know how when you have an eraser that's really dry, it's just crusty and it doesn't oh, move. My that's what, what that one was for me. And I tried erasing it and it made a darker mark than the pencil. And I was like, oh no, no, I'm, I'm not doing this. Messed up that whole page, couldn't even do it. I had to fix it with Photoshop, it was a mess. Any eraser that makes a mark is bad in my <laughs> house. Wait, I, I have a question though, because there is a mechanical eraser pencil eraser and it's in a long stick, like a, a lead, except it's an eraser. Oh yeah. We're not talking about those, right? No, okay. No, 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 Cause no, I no, love no, those. No. Okay. No, no, <laughs> I, I, I'm in the same line as you. I like those ones, but these are made by the enemy. I've never it's used like, one and I never will now. It's like the anti-eraser. Like it does the opposite of what it's supposed to do. It just upsets me. Like anytime I have an eraser it doesn't work, it makes me really mad. Erasers should work. It's really not that difficult. And yet a lot of them don't.